In a passionate call to the nation, Pastor Evans Mazurunim, founder of King of Kings Evangelical Ministries, has urged Nigerians to embrace the power of prayer, faith, and patience as the country faces its current challenges. Pastor Mozulunim stated this while speaking with John List on the sidelines of the 30th anniversary celebration of the King of Kings Evangelical Mission, or church rather, in Lagos. Plus TV correspondent Love Oyedokumo reports that while the pastor called for prayers, Senior Advocate of Nigeria, Femi Falano S.A.N., taxed churches to harness their growing influence in society and join issues with the courts to ensure that the law is used to make life better for the people. The milestone event took place at the church's headquarters in Lagos. It was attended by thousands of worshippers, community leaders, dignitaries and special guests who gathered to reflect on the church's remarkable journey. The anniversary featured a series of events including powerful Thanksgiving services and inspirational sermon by Apostle Asim Madubuku. In the beginning of the gospel, when I departed from Macedonia, no church communicated with me as concerning giving and receiving what he wanted. You know, Paul was, was an evangelist, was a man that was doing the work of God because of the love he has for God. Addressing a large congregation of worshippers, the founder of King of Kings Evangelical Ministries, Pastor Evans Mazuriem, acknowledged the difficult reality that many Nigerians are facing. He holds strongly that complaining about the situation or seeking violent means of resolution would not solve the problems. I advise every Nigerian to begin to burn your knees burn your hand, burn your light, pray. Because that St. Paul said it in a book of that, a book of Philippians chapter 4 verse 6. It said in everything, stop murmuring, don't complain, pray. In everything, through prayer, through supplications. Supplications are written petitions unto God. Write, submit, and thanksgiving. Make your request known unto Him. So that's the only thing I advise Nigerians to do. Senior Advocate of Nigeria, Femi Falano, was among the dignitaries. He spoke with journalists afterwards, addressing the role of churches in Nigeria in championing causes for the betterment of Nigerians. He urged the congregation to continue being a voice for the voiceless and to challenge injustices wherever they are found. Well, uh, the churches in Nigeria have become a powerful force to reckon with to that extent the churches have to necessarily reflect the wishes of their members the aspirations of their members by joining issues with the government to make life better make life comfortable for our people while commending the host pastor evans mazriem Falano also charged church leaders who engage with the legal system, challenge oppressive policies, and actively work to improve the lives of the poor and marginalized in society. In praying for the souls of people, our churches must also identify with the suffering and the hardship that our people are going through. You have many majority of leaders in the country, majority of political leaders subscribe to the Christian faith and the Muslim faith. So church leaders or churches must take them to task and ensure that the oath of office taken by them is lived through. Falano's comments come at a time when many Nigerians are disillusioned with the state of the nation's political and legal systems. Love Uyeduku, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.